we, we know each other pretty well. I will not uh, hide that. So um, I still have prepared a little list uh, of questions, but uh, I could do without uh, almost. Um, last year, we had also the pleasure to, to, to welcome you here. And uh, uh, I was delighted to, to, to lead uh, your interview, your on-stage interview myself. And you were, you were explaining last year how you started IGO right after college, uh, after Tsinghua University, we are at Tsinghua University here, um, with, uh, um, actually you're not from Beijing, you're, you're from uh, Xi'an, Xi Xi uh, which used to be uh, uh, the um, capital uh, in ancient times of, of China a long time ago. <clears throat> So you start, last year uh, you were explaining to us how you started your company, IGO, right after college, back in 92, with just 200 RMB generously given to you by your mother. 220. 220. <laughs> 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 which, which was at that time $26, right, if I'm not mistaken. So... Um, we, the, the, the interview was, was, was recorded. Many, many people uh, watched it live last year. Many people uh, recorded it. So uh, we're not going to redo the interview this time. But um, I was, my first question is probably how, uh, how did you create a leading tech brand? What does it take to create a leading tech brand here in China? Uh, good question. Yeah, here we based in Tsinghua, so thanks to the, the university. So there is in Chinese, I don't know how to translate to, to English. Yeah, Hou De Zai Wu, Zi Qiang Fu Xi. So, uh, foreign friends, so please, yeah. We have, sim we have simultaneous translation, so do not hesitate to get your headset on that. <laughs> I, I, should, I just uh, finished an intensive class of six months of Chinese. I should be able to translate that, but uh, for some reason. <laughs> yeah, so. We changed to uh, six wing. That means the weather chain uh, can be like a snowball. So to make the business bigger and bigger and uh, very safe. So it's need hou de zai wu, zi qiang bu xi. Um, but uh, perhaps you cannot understand this. So that's strategy. So if you want to be a long term, to be number one, yeah, so there are another good way in IT industry, I think. Uh, that is one plus one. Yeah, if the two, one, have the same direction, same dreams, and yeah, and the different position, very important, different position. So it can be one plus one, can be how much? 11. Yeah, so it can create value. And in IT industry, yeah, in internet, there are so many chances to make the one plus one equal to 11. Yeah, so we are very lucky because now this, this time is for, it's good for yeah, cooperation, it's good for teamwork. Yeah, so Hou De Zai Wu, Zi Qiang Bu Xi, it's good for one plus one equal to 11. Okay, so. Um does that explain, I mean, is it, so, so if I, I follow your, your reasoning, uh, it means that uh, foreign companies, foreign companies, foreign tech companies who found it very complicated to start operations here in China, for some of them, they are not very good at mathematics? <laughs> ah, yeah, so um, I think there is a very easy way to understand the one plus one equal to 11. Um, uh, so I think uh, the foreign friends, if you want to understand China, it's a very easy way for you that to learn the rule of Chinese chess. And for Chinese students, for Chinese entrepreneurs, if you want to go out of the world, please learn chess. The two chess the international chess and the Chinese chess, their character is very similar, but the rule is absolutely different. <laughs> it's very strange. Yeah, but if you understand the rule, oh, you will understand, oh, everything's so easy, not complicated. And why I can speak English? You know, I've never been abroad to learn English, to study. 
but why I can speak? Because after I learned the international chess, I find, oh, the English is pinyin, is similar with pinyin in China. So in China, who learn pinyin? Only children, it's very easy. But most Chinese students, we learn English more than 20 years. Yeah, we can get high score in examination, but most of, most of us cannot speak out. Why? Because we use Chinese chess way to learn, and you never can, <coughs> can learn it, can understand it. Yeah, but if, if you use another way, you use the international chess way to learn, it's very easy. Yeah, so this is the same. So foreign friends, if you want to understand China, so learn Chinese chess, it's very easy. So you will understand, oh, why Chinese people think this way? They have a river. Yeah, so the Chinese people, the Chinese friends, we eat the food is baozi. I don't know how to translate. Steamed bun. Bread, bread, ah. right? Steamed bread. Yeah, no, 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 it's, oh. it's meat inside. Oh yeah, yeah meat inside, yeah, yeah, baozi. And dumpling, mm. and the mooncake, yue bing. Mm. Uh, jiaozi shi, yeah. Dumpling, yeah. Dumpling, right. Yeah, right. so mm. pear. So it's like the, a, some kind of ravioli. Because yes, in but. Chinese chess, there is a river. So all the things, all the good things must be inside, cannot show out. Yeah, but in international chess, no river. So <clears throat> Mr. Marco Polo, like you, yeah. Marco Polo come to China and uh, find the pear very good and uh, take back to Italy and uh, put the meat, the good things outside to change it to pizza. Yeah, so now everywhere pizza popular. Yeah, so actually it's ori original from, from pear. Right. Yeah, but no one eat pear now. And uh, everyone eat pizza, why? Because this is the international chairs, no river, show out. Yeah, but, but, but same time, uh, the innovation in China, why is so great? Many, so many good innovations. Yeah, because in Chinese chess, there is a cannon, two cannon. Yeah, this is the special. The international chess never have cannon. So you cannot understand one country to rule. Yeah, like the Hong Kong problems, yeah. So Mr. Deng Xiaoping solve it in a Chinese way, in a Chinese chess way. And the China, you know, Russia, uh, CCCP, before to the reform about the uh, economic. Uh, the yeah. Soviet Union, former yeah, Soviet, Soviet Union. Union. Yeah. yeah, Soviet Union. Yeah, they, mm, they play ch international chess. Mm. So they have not the canon. So they changed the rule one night, and the disaster. But China, very clever. Mr. Deng Xiaoping in 1979, yeah, he chose four city in south of China, Shenzhen, Zhuhai, and uh, put four cannon there to try the free market, free market. economic, mm. yeah, that place. And uh, very successful after 13 years in 1992. Yeah, he go there and uh, mm, talk to all the Chinese people. How about Shenzhen? Everyone say, that's, that's good. So should follow? Okay, so change, and everything okay. So one country to rule, this is a canon. If something we cannot exceed, so uh, use the canon way to surpass and to solve the problem. Like the Chinese drinking, uh, Wang Lao Ji. Have you drink that? You mean Baijiu? Bai no, 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 uh, drinking. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Wang Lao Ji, Liang Cha, a Chinese thing. This is the Chinese med medicine. Yeah, so that's a canon. Because um, I cannot translate it. <laughs> yeah, please try it. Yeah, that uh, drinks very well. Yeah, and uh, same with Coca Cola. And sometimes perhaps you will feel better than Coca Cola. Yeah, why not? Yeah, so everyone can try. So we can learn from each other. Okay, okay, I, I know what. Uh, <laughs> okay, you mean the red, the red beverage? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The famous red beverage. Wang Lao Ji, remember? Oh, okay, it. Wang Lao Ji. Wang Lao Ji. Yeah, no need to translation. So this yeah. is the brand, Wang Lao Ji. Wang Lao Ji, which is selling much more than Coca Cola here, right? And yeah, it's yeah, more expensive yeah. In China than now, yeah. expensive than mm. Coca Cola and uh, sell best, sell better, mm. more than 
because for, people for some reason think that it's good for health and it's like a medicine, right? Yeah, so that's a typical international chess plus canon. Yeah, that's a typical one plus one equal to 11. So you will look like Coca-Cola because it's a can and a right. Looks far away, it's very similar, but the content is different. The content is not Coke, it's Liang Cha. How to say that? Liang Cha, that means a kind of tea, mm, something like that. A Chinese medicine to make your feel better, to make your mm, health, this kind of thing. So uh, if I understand well, the, the secret would be uh, you keep, uh, you, if, if you want to make it in China, you, you can use uh, Chinese ingredients, but you keep your, you do your own recipes. Yeah, similar to that. That means we should um, learn carefully from the international. There are so many good samples, but you should have um, some idea. Um, suitable for China market. Suitable for, you know, 1.3 billion people here. And their culture, their habit is different. So they eat, they'd like to eat those kind of food. So uh, you should learn from the outside. Then you, uh, 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 it's, for example, my, my suit. What kind is my suit? It's a white suit or Chinese suit. Mm -hmm. yeah. This is a combined, one plus one. Yeah, so the Chinese government before, if with this, this so many circles, uh, it's, it will look very <laughs> strange, so I cannot uh, bring them there, mm. here. But here, this is a little like the uh, suit. So very simple. But here you can see, uh, mm -hmm. you can see Lucky, mm -hmm. a Chinese character here. Mm -hmm. So this, uh, Typical international chess plus canon. Mm. Yeah, so Interesting. yeah, so use this way to think. So we should learn from others, learn from good friends, and you have your special things, and combine them together to make your cust your customer happy, to make everything better. So, Fang Jun, a few years ago when we met, if we take the, 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 the problem um, the, the, the other way around, meaning uh, a few years ago when we met, you were one of the very first high-tech company uh, trying to expand overseas, yeah. outside of China. Yeah. When most of Chinese companies at that time had no interest whatsoever in international markets, they had so much to do here, they were not interested in much. Um, this, this, is, this seems to be, to be changing. Uh, is it also your opinion? Mm, yeah. I think um, after next year, after the London Olympic, there will be more and more Chinese companies will understand. So it's a great chance for China company to cope with the world. And, uh, you know, now with the Internet, the, the global, Addition now actually is a uh, one global and uh, China <laughs> Chinese entrepreneurs work very hard and they have many many innovations if this innovation can only here It's a it's a pity so if you can copy you can one plus one equal to 11 with partners all over the world Yeah, it's great like you Yeah, why you come to China? Yeah, why you didn't stay in your country? <laughs> Here, we bridge it. Yeah, so there are many, many interesting things will happen. So one plus one equal to 11. It can create new value. Yeah, so after London Olympic, after July the 27th, more and more Chinese people will understand. This will be a top secret. Yeah, so you will see then. So tell me, I heard you, you, you created a specific stru structure called IGO Study Club in order to help Chinese companies to export their brands overseas. Yeah. Is that true? Yeah. That we find if you want company, if you go overseas, yeah, it's hard work. So we want to learn from Olympic. So to choose 
different uh, brand, only one brand from every different field. And all together, we can <coughs> go to all over the world and uh, to create value <coughs> for the people there and uh, to branding together and uh, to do many things together. You know, <coughs> made in China in many people's many friends idea is low end but actually uh, made in china there are two kind yeah so some of them the number one brands they want to do good things they have good reputation and they want to create more value and they work very hard and uh, have many many innovations but because of um, the whole image is low end so that means many many good brands you cannot know uh, so we want to uh, teamwork uh, with these good brands together and um, in every field, different field. A little like um, Hui Yuan from drinking, you know, and Wang Laoji, yeah, and uh, uh, Li Ning, yeah, from the, the spot close, yeah. So different fr brands, we together to go to UK, go to Belgium, go to Japan, go to United States, go to different places and have an incubator. And uh, we have the learning, Igo Learning Club to learn from each other, to share the experience yeah, together and uh, to do good things together and uh, to monitor together. <laughs> and if you do some bad thing and uh, <coughs> we all together will monitor. Yeah, not a lot. Yes. Guanxi style. <laughs> style. Uh, yeah. that, that, that's great. Um, you, you, um, you created recently a new company called Smart Cloud. Yeah. Can you tell us a little bit more about that? Oh, it's a great thing. Yeah, now you know, it, now it's the IPv6 world. And perhaps the Smart Cloud company, we named it in Chinese, named Jin Dou Yun. Yeah, so this word will be very popular in future. So foreign friends, please remember this, this word. Jin Dou Yun. Yeah, so if in China you can see all this word, that means you are a good Lao Wai. <laughs> okay, yeah, so, uh, so Jin Dou Yun. A good Lao Wai mean, uh, <laughs> means a, a good foreigner, right? Yeah, and, good, uh, good friends. <laughs> unlike, unlike, uh, unlike being a Sha Lao Wai, which is a. Uh, yeah, because right? you show the respect to China culture. Yeah, Jin Dou Yun is the monkey king. The monkey king, uh, he has the Shi Wan Ba Qian Li. That means he has the way to machine to machine. So you now you know this is the IPv6 world. So uh, we we have a system, yeah, Jin Dou Yun system that we give everyone uh, every machine. Yeah, you have many many, many machines. You have two mobile phone, three computer. So we give you a system to name it. So IPv6. So everything can have. Uh, so Feng Jun, <coughs> Feng Jun to mobile phone one to Igo, this one. Another mobile phone will phone to uh, uh, mobile phone two to different, different IP address. Yeah, so that means, uh, and we use the IPv6 and we use the smart cloud, and uh, we can communicate, mm. yeah, um, with internet, and uh, we can find you directly. So we can machine to machine directly. So this company perhaps will be a great company. Yeah, we uh, joint venture. We one plus one with Freebit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we are very happy. Uh, now the former chairman of Sony, Idei san, mm -hmm. now is our independent uh, board member. Yeah, he loves this. Yeah, because this IPv6 is a new standard. And for Asian uh, countries, our IPv4 now is out. Yeah, so not enough. So we must change to IPv6. So perhaps this will make people very happy, yeah, because um, in future, you know, if your children uh, go to somewhere, yeah, and uh, your wife want to know everything about him, yeah, so your, your boy, your children, just take photo or video and uh, just push to machine to machine to his mother. So the that I like, but I don't want my wife to know everything. Uh, <laughs> I'm not sure I'm a big fan of, of that device. <laughs> but your wife will care about your children, yeah. Okay. Okay, <laughs> so and, uh, before we must use the email to put there and uh, uh, your wife find the picture from the, the email server.
but now no need. So can machine to machine, directly to the mobile phone, directly to the digital photo frame on his table, on her table, on, uh, beside the bed, yeah, everywhere can put. That means the picture uh, will directly to, to there. So this will be a big mm, business model in, in future. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Um, I don't want to, to, to take too much of your time because I, I know that you have to, to see uh, Prime Minister Wang Jiabao uh, just after that, and your staff is going to kill me if I don't let you go sometime soon. So I just want to ask you uh, one last question. Um, do you think China, and this is a question whose answer is targeted to our international audience who's watching us right now uh, on, on the web, um, do you think China is a great place for a foreign entrepreneur to start a company? Yeah, before not, but now it will be. And after next year, after the London Olympic, China uh, will be a great place for entrepreneur. But please remember, you, if you want to be an entrepreneur in China, you must understand Chinese chess. Yeah, if you don't understand Chinese chess, here, you will be in trouble. Yeah, so understand Chinese chess and respect the Chinese culture and find a partner in China, one plus one equal to 11. It's very easy for, China, for foreign yeah, entrepreneurs to snowball, mm. to create value in China and in the world. Can I find the two partners, meaning one plus one plus one equal I yeah, it's 111? Yeah. It's even better, right? Yeah. So okay. you can be the bridge. So thank you. Thank All right. you very much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Fangju. Okay. Pleasure. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.